If you're looking for cheap, safe, and reliable MT, make sure you go check out my new sponsor, SafeMBAMT.com. Use code JC2K for 5% off and go build that God Squad you always wanted. Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. Coming at y'all with this video, and as y'all can see, the daily spin for Friday just um, reset. So, logging in for the seventh day this week, gonna be able to spin the weekly wheel, and obviously, that's going to give me a guaranteed dark matter Elvin Hayes. So, we are going to be doing Elvin Hayes gameplay, obviously, today. Um, card looks solid. At least he looks better than Trey Young. I'll say that last week we got Trey Young. Trey Young was terrible. But I am interested to see this card, how this card is, and uh, just do gameplay with him to show y'all if this card is going to be good enough to make it in your lineup. Obviously, it's a free Dark Matter. He's not terrible, but I do think there are some things that he is lacking a little bit that might hold him back, so I am interested to see how that works. But before we hop into this video, if you haven't, make sure you uh, hit that subscribe button. Help us push towards the 2,000 subscriber mark in the... 2,000 subscriber mark on the channel, um, up at 2 in the morning recording this video, so uh, yeah, definitely on the grind, and uh, yeah, without further ado, let's hop right into it. Take a look at Mr. Elvin Hayes. So, Mr. Hayes is... Obviously, 99 overall, 99 offense, 99 defense, 6'9", 235 pounds at the power forward or center position, 97 driving layup, 95 mid, not only an 83 pointer, but a 95 driving dunk, 86 ball handle, really good defensive stats all the way around, great rebounding as well as a 96 speed, 95 speed of the ball, 96 acceleration, 95 lateral quickness. So really at everything except for shooting, he looks elite. Um, and the 95 driving and flashy dunk tendency as well also comes with a 99 pass interception, 98 on ball steal, 98 contest, and 98 block shot tendency. So tendencies look really good. Stats look really good with the exception of his shooting. 48 hops as well as super nice catch and shoot. Postman technician, drop stepper, ankle breaker, break starter, lob city finisher, pickpocket, rim protector, chase down ours box, clamps, defensive leader, heart crusher, interceptor, intimidator, moving truck, rebound chaser, pogo stick, post move, lockdown, trapper, worm, back down punisher, consistent contact finisher, pick and roller, fancy footwork, fast break finisher, pro touch, showtime, slithery, bailout, downhill, quick first step, unpluckable, brick wall, a lot of really good defensive and finishing badges, um, doesn't come with a lot of good shooting badges, but does have gold corner specialist as well as dimer, pick dodger, handles for days, stop and go tight, handle screen machine, hot zone hunter, tyler shooter, volume shooter, does not come with dead eye, does not come with flexible, does not come with range extender, those three cards badges are absolutely crucial to this card if you are going to use them in your lineup um also blinders if you're on next to him besides that he does look like a very very solid option so let's hop into freestyle and see what this card can do so i want to check out this El this elvin hayes card first of all he's too heavy to curry slide so even though he does have the size up he can't curry slide even though he's six foot nine which is a little bit unfortunate um release wise that was not a good test what is this release it's kind of weird a little bit slow Honestly, looks like it has like a very defined green endo, but it's kind of kind of slow, a little bit gross. Uh, not a bad release, actually. I think from the corner, it's actually pretty knocked down. Yeah, his release has a very, very clear green window. Um, and I'm greening with an 83 pointer. Um, hot spots are only the corners. Obviously, release is not, or shooting is not going to be a strong point, though. He does have pro three behind the back as well. As a slasher, defender, and. Um, Honestly, dribble, he's going to be really good at the power forward position with 96 speed, 95 acceleration, 96 speed of the ball as well. Like, that's going to be super nice. Only thing about this card that is going to hold him back is his low three point rating and the fact that he is missing those hot spots. But if you do add the shooting badges that he needs to this card, add a three point shoot him, I think he's going to be serviceable enough as a shooter as well. So uh, it'll really be up to you to see if this card makes it into your lineup. Without further ado, let's hop into some triple threat and see what he can do. Get the ball right back to him. Pro 3, yes sir, good animation, we'll take that layup animation, it's good stuff. Why are you pausing me? He shoots an early board. Y'all gotta get a freaking board, bro, just gives up a wide open look again. <sighs> get the ball right back to him, he's just gonna go back and paint sit probably. Nope, he didn't actually paint sit, credit to him. We'll live with it. Show Tommy, he's a great slasher, I like it a lot. Oh, yes, sir. Good D, baby. I got to see some greens out of you. Good shot, though. I'll take that big white. Let's go. Got all nine of our points as well. Cards hooping so far. Pinch. That's got to be my steal. Good D. Yeah. Give me that. Let's go. Pro three me. Yep. So, pro three again contact me hey oh that's a nice dunk animation i like it a lot give me a stop good d that's 
great defense. Luca, I see you. Luca hooping on defense. Oh, that's beautiful. Got to get a stop, another stop here. We can get this guy out of here. I thought he was going to quit because triple threat, obviously. But good D, Luca. Luca is being a sit man on defense right now. It's a great move. Good move by my opponent. Give him credit. Run our pick and fade here. Going to get the ball to Mr. Luca. Obviously, he's got sharp tech. Got to take advantage of it if you can. Get a wide open look. Luca, chicken man. Good shot, baby. Now give me a steal. Hey. Get a hand up. Board. Let's go. Get it to him. Chicken wide open. Got a green. My fault, man. Good D. Good D. That's fine. We'll get contact. I don't care about that, honestly. That's cool. ball in good he's fouling imagine fouling me just get it back to him we're good kind of hard to run a triple dot offense through a guy like this he really can't shoot the ball very well but hey he's doing a great job as a slasher and even a distributor get a wide open look as well got a board good great job getting that board kick it right back out to luca knock down green animation we'll take that need one more buck or two more buckets in this game Honestly, just let this dude shoot the ball. I don't even care. He's just kind of like wasting my time at this point. Wide open, Luca. No way he just knocked that down. Look at Luca. I'm going to get this last bucket with Elvin, though, just, just to close this one out. He's played good. Good D. He greened that. <laughs> And that was a stick, too. He's trying to do a post spin. We'll live with it. It's fine. Get it in. Pro three. Slash the rim. Another slash. And he, that 96 speed on a big is so, so nice. 13 points, two rebounds, one assist, and a steal. Let's hop a no more game. See if he can keep, keep on hooping. This man's got Dick, and then he's got two. Uh, interesting. He's got two of the free dudes, McAdoo and Elvin Hayes. So actually, I would say these two cards are very similar. Honestly, the only difference is that uh, Elvin's probably a little more athletic, slightly better defensive card. And then... Uh, McAdoo um, is probably a slightly better shooter, I guess, and the fact that he can carry slide. Both of them are missing hotspots and have pretty low three-pointers, which is a big deal for cards like this, but this man's trying to sweat me, I can tell, with uh, Van Arsdale. So I didn't even see which Van Arsdale that was. Nice move, though, by Elvin. He is so fast with the ball. That's the one thing I do notice with him. He, he, at, for a big, like he moves phenomenally. Great dribble, Sigs. Really, really nice all-around card. I just got to see a little bit more from him as a shooter. And honestly, I think adding those shooting badges that I haven't added to him will definitely help him if you do want to use this card. Let's see if he winds up shooting the ball. It's good defense. He shot a late. Board me. Yes, sir. Chill. Chill. Oh, yes. Cooked him. Oh, my Lord. He moves. Y'all see him moving like a guard? This is impressive. And he dancing, too. Yes, sir. I like it. Now sweep and give me a steal. Good D. Sit on him. Yup. He's just dancing around with Tom, but he's not that good of a or is this dick? I don't even know. But it's not that he's not that good of a dribble. I don't know. Not too impressed. Just basic speed boost curry slide. Put up a bad shot. Not impressed. Nice job. Good stuff, Elvin Hayes. Alright, honest conclusion about Elvin Hayes. He's not gonna play in my lineup. I don't think he's going to play in a lot of lineups, but if you're a nobody spin player, you're a budget player, you need a power forward or a center option who's athletic, who can play defense, who can slash really well. He's a good card. He moves phenomenally. He's got great dribble six. Just the shooting is going to hold him back. The lack of hotspots and the low three-pointer are definitely going to hold him back. You add a three-point shoot him, you add those badges to him, it is definitely going to help him become much more usable, I think, even at a competitive level, at a low-end competitive level. Not a great card by any means, but definitely not a bad card. And for a free dark matter, especially for people who are in need of guys to fill roles like this, Elvin Hayes is not a bad card at all. So if you do enjoy this video, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment as well. Let me know what you think of this card, and uh, let me know if you're excited about tomorrow's content drop as well. Um, also, if you haven't, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help us push towards the 2,000 subscribe mark on the channel. And I'm going to go to bed. So y'all boys have an awesome night. I appreciate all the support as always. And we'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon. I appreciate y'all. Peace.